In the dimly lit confines of his opulent office, Donald Trump sat behind his grand mahogany desk, the glow of the television casting shadows across his furrowed brow. The news anchor's voice echoed through the room, announcing the latest poll results. Kamala Harris had surged ahead, leaving Trump trailing behind. His eyes narrowed, a flicker of disbelief crossing his face. He leaned forward, gripping the edge of the desk, knuckles whitening. The room seemed to close in around him, the weight of the unexpected news pressing down. He reached for his phone, fingers trembling slightly, and began to scroll through social media, searching for validation, for any sign that this was a mistake. But the numbers were clear. Harris was in the lead. A storm brewed within him, a mix of anger and determination. He slammed the phone down, the sound reverberating through the room. This isn't over, he muttered to himself, voice low and resolute, not by a long shot. With renewed vigor, he began to strategize, plotting his next move. The game was far from finished, and Trump was ready to fight back with every ounce of his being.